Hello, it's Peter here from Woodrow Handcrafts in Gympie and in this video I'm just going to show you how you can open a design using the Horizon Link Suite if you memory craft 15,000 and then write that to a USB stick. So the first thing you need to do is open your Horizon Link Suite and this is the window that you'll be that you'll get. Click on the EMB Link tool uh, and then click on Editing Embroidery Designs. So once you've clicked on Editing Embroidery Designs, this is what you should see. You've got three tabs here, Home, Edit and View. In your Home tab, this is where you can select your hoop size. So if I click on that, the drop down a menu of your available hoops and select SQ23 for this one. And then along the top here you've got your link manager, uh, you've got your designs and your lettering. So what we want to do is open a design. So if I click on design, then gives me this option here so I can look through my PC to find the design, my designs that I've saved to my PC. Uh, so they can be anywhere that you've saved them. You've got a quick reference over here. I want to use ones that are just built in to the memory craft 15,000 so they're installed in the design folder. I click on design folder and then you're given all these design collections here. The one I want to use today is World of Embroidery Designs and the SQ23 designs once that opens up and you can scroll through here until you find the design that you'd like to use. Um, it's the one I'd like to use over here, number 16, and you'll see that brings that into the center of your hoop straight away for you. If you want to add another design to that, you can just by clicking on design, and that will open it back up into where you were previously. If you want to go back, so I want to use one of the design sets, a SQ14 design, so go up one level go into the SQ14 designs and scroll through until you find the design that you want. That's the one I want there, number 51. Click on that one. So I'll just edit this one a little bit. So I want to make it a little bit smaller and then I want to put it into the four corners. So with the resize I can click here up or down, up to 120%, down to 80%. I just want to take that down to I take that down to 80% and take that up into the corner there. Now I'd like to have it in all four corners. So you can click on the copy and paste and move those around if you like. Or you've got over here you've got a cornering tool. So I've got the design selected that I'd like to put in the corner. So you've got the green box around that design there. Put it in the corner, click on the corner, and there you go. You've got the four designs straight into the corner for you. Now what I want to do is I'd like to write that to you, that design to my USB stick because I haven't got my memory craft 15,000 turned on at the moment. So I click on it, write a design, double click on that into the EMBF folder, click on rename, give it a name, press OK and click on the red arrow and that writes that design straight to your USB stick. If you'd like to send straight to your uh, MemoryCraft 15000, the way you'd do that is you'd have your MemoryCraft 15000 turned on, you'd have it in embroidery mode and you wouldn't have anything, any design loaded on the screen. Then you can click on the send. So my machine, my computer here tells me that I haven't got anything connected. If you had it connected via uh, USB or via Wi-Fi, that would just go straight over for you. 